Today we're opening a massive collection box. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today I'm gonna be opening up two different collections that I bought, one is sealed product and one is single cards, but first we have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these three cards of Perfect Machine King, Reflect Bounder, and Dark Necrofear. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed. Let me know if you prefer singles or sealed product. I think that'll be interesting to see in the comments. So first off, we are going to start with the small singles binder that I got from a viewer. So let's see what is inside. I don't really remember. I remember it was a few nice cards. It was like a low amount of cards, but they were very quality. So quantity low, quality high. Okay, let's see what was inside. So, oh, here we go. These were from John Gabath. That's his IG. Let's see. He has about 1,875 is what his, uh, his estimate is. So let's see what is in here. I think there's some ultimate rares and stuff. So inside we have the Destroyer Saurus. I always really like the artwork on this card. That guy's from Power. Power of the Duelist. That's really cool. Master Hyperion. Ooh, a glow up bulb. This is a cool card. Let's see about this one. We've got ourselves an ulti glow up bulb, which is pretty cool for like Edison format and things like that. Very nice card in there. We also have the Thunder King Ryo. That is an epic ultimate rare. Very cool card. Of course, the Neo Spatian Grand Mall is a classic as well. You love to see that. And the Dandelion up there is also really cool. Oh, here's some sick cards. We've got a BLS ulti right here. This is an OCG card BLS. Let's check this out. That card looks incredible. I mean, it's not in fantastic shape. As you guys can see, it's a little bent, a little scratched up, but that is a really Really cool card to run in like a goat deck. This would be really, really cool. Then there's an honest up there. We have an element of hero stratus ulti. We already do have one of these. We could get closer to the play set. We've got a Neos alias ultimate rare. Wow, there's some really cool stuff like Edison in here, which I've mentioned Edison a few times because I played it a couple times recently. It's been really fun. We have a swap frog ulti. That's cool. Oh, a treeborn frog ulti. That's a first set. I think I have an unlimited in my deck, so I don't want to switch that one up. Oh, wow. Exodia. There's the unlimited reprint versus the ultimate rare. The ultimate rare looks so much better. Then we have uh, some limbs. Those look like maybe uh, some of them are. That one might not be a reprint. Some, Most of them are reprints. Yeah, that's a reprint. Okay, that's a reprint. That's a reprint. I think maybe the left arm is not. That's pretty cool. Oh, man. <laughs> Ulti Stardust and Black Rose. Wow. Okay, these are kind of overlapping. Let's be careful here. So there's a first ed Ulti Stardust Dragon from the Duelist Genesis. I love to see these cards. I don't think these were in amazing shape. I can't really remember. Oh, wow. Maybe they are in amazing shape. This card looks good. I mean, it has a few things at the top, but honestly, this is like lightly played at the worst, I would say. Very nice card. And of course, the Black Rose, there's the Goyo. Is that first edition? Oh, that is amazing. A first edition ultimate rare. Ally of Justice, Catastor. That's another very cool card. That's a turbo pack, so it doesn't come in first dead. Gaga Cowboy is always a classic. Levier, the Sea Dragon. That's a very expensive card, actually. Castell, and then of course, the number 101 Silent Honor Arc. And that, is that it? I think that's it. Yeah, so it's pretty low. I mean, there's not a lot of cards, but they're all pretty valuable. Next up, we have two different boxes with sealed items inside. So let's see what there are. All right, the first item, this looks like it's going to be mats. So this is going to be a little bit difficult to show. So this one, I don't know really where these came from. So this looks like, I don't know, just some sort of are these light sworns maybe i don't know that might be the light sworn mat then we have a dark magician girl mat you know which is probably not going to show this whole thing but you guys yeah you know it's dark magician girl and then we have a very large mat this one's like oh there's, and then there's a tiny mat inside okay wait there's one of these like little mouse pad ones called the uh the eternity code one i don't really know what they call these i guess they call them mouse pads because they're like really tiny but there's one of those and then a massive cyber dragon one that's just completely huge and i can't show the whole thing here we go maybe this is a better look at the other half so it's a very large mat and then we have the large box with sealed product inside First off, we have a monster. What is this? Mega deck box? This is actually insane. Look how long this thing is. This is like a foot of deck box. This is really cool. It holds five full-size decks. Okay, that's a good start. Then we have one, two, three, four, and five five photon shockwave first edition blisters so those are really nice oh and we have a note here okay so let's see what is inside the note hey rux thanks for helping me out i appreciate it a lot keep up with the amazing content love watching them when i'm winding down for the day enjoy the collection toe and aka toe and Show. you guys have probably heard him before on the outro credit when we're you know shouting everybody out all right so he sent us some cool stuff so it looks like for the community that will be added to the giveaway so let's see what is for the community guys looks like a pack we have a giveaway is this the uh the movie pack with the shining dragon is that what this is Oh, Rageki. 
Okay, yeah, the movie pack, that's awesome. Then we have a Raigeki, Blue Eyes White Dragon, Blue Eyes Shining Dragon, Blue Eyes White Dragon, and Blue Eyes White Dragon. Four Blue Eyes and Raigeki. Not bad. So all this will be out of the giveaway, so make sure you guys enter that, liking the video, subscribing. Let me know what you prefer, sealed or single cards. And here we have one for me, which is pretty cool, and this seems like a CGC slab from what I can tell. I'm gonna guess CGC slab. I'm gonna have to rip this thing, because the tape is making it difficult. Uh oh guys, avert your eyes, it's Pokemon. And then we have a Storming Wind promo. Elemental Hero Thunder Gen. What is this? Is that Mattel and Bacanio Moth. Wait, is this a Mattel card? So it looks like this is a Mattel promo card, which is actually pretty awesome. That is really, really cool. Thanks so much, Toen. That is actually a very unique card. I don't think I own this. Then we have the Charizard GX CGC 8.5. I have like a few CGC cards from you guys now at this point. Maybe at one point we'll actually send some cards to them and see what happens, but I have like several cards now, so thanks a lot, dude. Okay, here we have a bunch of single packs, which is pretty cool. Oh, this would make a fun video just to open all of these up. We have Rise of Destiny, two of those. Secrets of Eternity. Cross Souls. This is a weird way to hold this weight. We got two Cross Souls. We've got two new challengers. Extreme Vic. Three of those. Three Extreme Victory. We've got two Absolute Power Force. Three Storm of Ragnarok. We've got one of the Old Generation Force. Poor Generation Force. We've got one of the First Edition Ancient Prophecy. Those are actually pretty rare. We have a Blue Eyes White Dragon. That is a Konami logo. Red Konami logo. So that's like a 2003, 2004 pack. 2019 Gold Star People Dragoon. That'd be insane. We got another movie pack or two of those, which he gave away to one of you guys. Turbo packs here. We've got tournament pack 15. We've got tournament pack 14, tournament pack 13, two OTS one and two speed duel tournament pack ones. That's a lot of decent single packs. And that's not all. We got a lot more left. We have a special edition from Storm of Ragnarok. We've got a Chaos Impact first edition booster box. We've got some pretty good luck with this set. Maybe we could do it again. Who knows? And if you thought that was it, there's way more to come. We have more blister packs. Here's some really cool ones. The Duelist Genesis. Yeah, and a 499 tag on it. Yeah, that is pretty insane. Rise of the Duelist. And not one, not two. Okay, I'm not going to count all of them, but I think we have... Well, we will count, but not out loud. We've got 10 of these. Rise of the Duelist. One of the best sets of 2020 and maybe ever ever. Just an insane set. That's going to be fun to open those. And then we have, of course, Battles of Legend Armageddon. We opened a few of those packs back in the day. <laughs> Don't worry, there's more blisters. We have more Armageddon. Yes, more Armageddon, more chances for 10k Dragon. King's Court, there's some of those. Maybe we can pull the God card. We could pull Collector Rares. There's Legendary Duels, Rage of Raw for that. Who's Ghost Rares. You guys know we want to get those. A few more of those. More chances at the Ghost. We pulled a couple times, but it's still fun every time. And then Extreme Force First Edition. Not a lot to say about this one, really, but it's it's cool. And then, of course, the Eternity Code. Some of the best sets ever here. We got Eternity code rise of the duelist you know just some good stuff here's something i've never opened which is an entire invasion of not invasion of chaos this is a different set invasion vengeance special edition invasion of chaos would be cooler but this is still really cool special or super special variant cards well, let me let me move that there we go right there so in here i think like starting good infusion dragon is the cover card so i don't remember what all is in here well look here are the promos we can get the uh is that the relling karibo over there anything else any any good uh the little the pug guy yeah so pretty cool then we have a ton of sleeves so this is pretty awesome mini character sleeves so very nice always nice to have more sleeve to sleeve stuff up when you ship and when you make decks and stuff and then we have a rise of destiny first edition box yeah rise of destiny first edition that's pretty cool i don't remember if it's a hobby or retail but we will show right there we'll figure that out afterwards another booster box of rise of destiny is always awesome we got ourselves some oh wait some rush duel i should say promos pretty cool in there so those are sealed up that's i think that might be the dark magician girl and the pot of greed and all that stuff then we have a somewhat sealed it's a little bit opened this is the starter deck blue eyes one saga of the blue eyes white dragon or something like that here's a really cool product that i've never opened the speed duel battle city they're actually coming out with a gx one soon so this is pretty cool and we have not one but two it's eight complete decks inside and then there's some random secret rare promos so these are actually super fun if you just want to play a little bit of speed duel with your friends so that is pretty exciting to get those as well we are finally nearing the end. In here, we have a Dual Terminal 6. So this is the one with the Dark Magician Girl inside. I, is it sealed? No, it's not sealed. Okay. So in here, let, let's just we can just go through this real quick. So this is the way they would send these, like, for everyone with the Dual Terminals. They send them in these big boxes. And literally, all the cards are just, like, in here. So the ones you would pull would just kind of go in order like this. So we got all this. The Gem Knight. Is that a rare, I guess? There's a super rare. That's cool. Uh, so we got to find the Dark Magician Girl, of course. 
Unless this has been like, you know, pulled out or something. Macrocosm is cool. Oh, there it is. The Dark Magician Girl. So this is the big card of the set. Pretty crazy. It's just like a stack of like the cards that would come out of the dual terminal. It's weird. And the final couple items we have, we do have a Infinity Chasers booster box, which is actually kind of a cool set. I like a lot of the cards in here. And then we have to finish it out. Of course, one of our favorite products, the Monster Box. So we will definitely be opening this one on the channel. A ton of this stuff on the channel soon. So if you guys want to see anything in this video open on the channel, make sure you let me know in the comments what you want to see the most. And I'll try and get that into a video soon. Hope you guys enjoyed this collection purchase because this was a lot of sealed stuff. So a lot of really cool singles. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this in the future. Shout out to TCG Trusted Cards, Tomfo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Spanky McFarland, G Raider, Daxter, Ian Musa, and Junior Barding. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.